Hey guys, uh, we're still in algorithm window. Uh, and now uh, I will show you uh, if you have uh, a surface just like uh, RGB surface. And uh, of course you have three layers. If I, I delete uh, two layers, and how can I, uh, can I recreate this image uh, to be a natural color, three, two, one, uh, just like before? You know, uh, we mentioned it before, uh, we have to uh, go to edit and add raster layer and add a missed layers like green and uh, also red, okay? <clears throat> but it's empty, they are empty and you should load a data set to uh, uh, make them uh, available, okay? But we have another way, I just uh, mentioned it for uh, HFI, and uh, I can make copy and paste for this layer, or just make uh, selecting this layer and uh, click on duplicate uh, icon, okay, or button. So I will duplicate this layer uh, twice, okay, and I will change the, uh, the layer type, okay, change raster layer or change uh, uh, a layer type by just right clicking on it and changing it for uh, for uh, red okay or you just select uh, your uh, duplicated layer and go to edit and change you have changed raster layer and changing it to uh, let me see green to green okay so edit, change, uh, change raster layer to, you can change uh, your layer in any type that you want. And uh, it's uh, exactly the uh, same way, but uh, it's, uh, we can call it this way, I duplicate it's uh, more simple and uh, just like a shortcut way. Okay, but uh, because we have uh, an RGB color, uh, 3, 2, 1, it's a natural color. So the, I uh, should, uh, after recreating this uh, layers, uh, this image should look like a natural color, just like before, okay? But uh, actually, it doesn't like a natural color. Why? Because you have should, uh, you have uh, selected band 1 in blue, it's true, band 1, and in red, you should have band 3 and in green you should have band 2 okay so let me this out so 3 2 1 okay band 3 band 2 and band 1 but actually it's not a bit like a natural color it's a a false color actually so uh why it look like that? Because, you know, we uh, duplicated a blue layer in, uh, in uh, one, to recreate one of these uh, layers, okay? So, if using a uh, same um, color or same uh, uh, brightness and contrast of a blue layer, okay? So, for fixing that uh, situation, it's uh, very easy. You just go to uh, uh, green, selecting green layer, and go to uh, uh, this icon. It's edit transform limits. It's transformation. Okay? Or uh, I just recently had this toolbar. It's uh, named it common functions. Actually, it con uh, contains uh, uh, many functions that, that uh, we're recently using them for uh, when we. Uh, uh, working on ER matter. For example, we have right here uh, algorithm. Uh, algorithm. Uh, I can just uh, bring algorithm or opening algorithm just by clicking this icon and you have load data set right here. And also I have uh, edit transform limits. So, uh, to fix the uh, color uh, problem right here, to fixing it, uh, just clicking uh, edit transform limits. From Common functions toolbar or from algorithm. Okay. Uh, this transform uh, window or the transform uh, limits window 
I just to uh, make the green uh, to be unnatural, I just go to limits and limit to actual. Okay. And also selecting a red color from here or just leaving here. The same thing. Okay. <coughs> here or here. <coughs> same point. Sorry. And also clicking on limits limits to actual you see it uh, you know somewhat look like a natural color but we have uh, also available templates right here you can just clicking on uh, the uh, anyone which uh, we think it's uh, our image uh, be uh, uh, have a natural color uh, just like before okay uh, you know uh, I think it's a good, a good template for uh, just showing the color uh, uh, or distribution of the color and also the contrast and the brightness uh, of these layers. So if you have any issues of, uh, you know, showing colors in a grayscale or in RGB, you should go to uh, this icon, it is transform limits, it's pre -pro uh, after processing and also uh, here the same thing and uh, let the colors limit to actual or uh, you can change any templates ready templates right here or changing the uh, the uh, amount of uh, a color uh, which you want uh, manually okay and um, you know, for changing raster layer, you have two ways, right-clicking on it, and also edit, change raster layer, okay? And, uh, you know, this uh, all about the uh, recreating uh, new uh, layers when you deleting it, okay? But uh, remember that when you add, for example, we deleted these two layers and we recreating it, you should uh, notice that the data set which you selecting it if you add or uh, go to edit and add raster layer uh, you should it's no data set when you load a data set it should be have a same uh, or uh, be for the same image okay or for the same data set uh, Landsat TMU uh, 1985 .ers for uh, because to be you know just like a, a, a normal or a natural color uh, just like before okay so each layer should contain a same data set to recreate your uh, image and uh, another notice in uh, layers uh, you know if I change for example blue layer to pseudo layer it be unavailable uh, you see across on the pseudo layer because pseudo layer is not available or not uh, you know readable uh, in RGB color okay so you should uh, turning uh, it to uh, blue okay and so on for the others for example in pseudo layer you have or pseudo surface you have pseudo layer if you changing it to red it will be sorry, it will be uh, unavailable okay we should return it uh, up to uh, pseudo layer and so on for the uh, another uh, for example in hue saturation if I change it to red it will be unavailable because uh, it's not suitable as a layer for this uh, surface okay uh, sorry, let me turn it up this. And um, also, another important notice you should uh, remember that uh, in, uh, in surfaces uh, or in layers, when you deleting layer or uh, adding layer or recreating layer, uh, you know, we load a same data set, but 
you can also <coughs> load a different data set. For example, you have Landsat TMU and 1985, 1985, and I, I will change this data set uh, or change the blue layer uh, and load a different data set. Okay, for that purpose, just click on a blue layer and click load data set. And for example, we have Lansa TM here 1991. Dot ERS, but you should not click on OK because if you click on OK, these uh, data set will uh, will be added for uh, all three bands for red and green and blue. We don't uh, want this. We want just to add this data set to blue layer only. So you should click on apply this layer only or OK this layer only. The same thing. It, uh, if you press in OK, it will be uh, uh, closed. Uh, this window will be closed and <coughs> your data set will be added. Okay? So I will press on OK this layer only, not OK. OK this layer only. <coughs> so you notice in red you have uh, 1985, in green you have 1985, and in blue you have 1990, 1991. So uh, you can, uh, we have a raster with RGB with uh, three. Uh, layers, uh, but we have a blue layer, different uh, uh, data set uh, containing different data set uh, comparing to the uh, blue, uh, comparing to the green and red.